Hi everyone, welcome back to the another video of Genus Academy. So friends, imagine there is a scenario. You are driving a high-tech uh, car that is having V2X technology inbuilt in that car. And uh, let's say you are going for a shopping in a big mall which is then in the middle of the city. There is always a problem of parking. Like this is the big size mall. The the majority of the people are coming there so there will be always a issue of parking and this parking issue can be solved by implementing the v2x technology let's say your car is having that module that system is installed that is of v2x technology and that mall the parking system in that mall they also having a communication technology of v2x which is installed so all of the vehicles which are coming there to park their vehicle in that mall the mall itself will get notified the availability of the parking in all of the vehicles which are coming there so, so friend over here you will get a notification of the availability of the parking the whether the parking is available or not so whether the parking is available you will get a notification and then you will go and park your vehicle there and enjoy the journey rest of the journey so friend over here the problem is getting solved that is the availability of the parking that is just because installing this module this system this is a communication system which is known as the v2x communication over here v refers the vehicle vehicle to x over here x can be anything it can be infrastructure it can be another vehicle, it can be a pedestrian or else it can be another network. So over here vehicle to X refers to vehicles to everything. It is a communication technology or we can call it as a communication module which is gets installed in the latest upcoming cars, upcoming automobiles. So friend over here in this particular video, we are going to learn about this technology v2x technology so if you are new over here on my educational channel genius academy kindly subscribe and please press the bell icon so whenever i upload I like this kind of the informative videos you will get instant notification so let's begin with our today's video of v2x communication <laughs> So friends, in that uh, scenario, we have solved the problem of parking, but in the similar way, we can solve many of the problems such as the majority of the road accidents. The number of, of the road accidents can be reduced exponentially by implementing this V2X communication. The problem of the traffic, it can eliminate the problem of the traffic. This V2X communication establishes a secure communication technology between vehicle to everything over here everything means it can be infrastructure another vehicle pedestrian or a network so vehicle to everything that is v2x it is comprises of v2i that is vehicles to infrastructure v2v that is vehicle to vehicle v2n vehicles to another network and v2v and v2p vehicles to pedestrian so it combines all of this it means the vehicle which you are using like it is a communication network so you will be getting all the broadcasting signals of different different vehicles you will be notified where where you are going okay and the the scenario over there the number of vehicles are there the, whether the at suppose let's say you are over here in uh, Mumbai and you want to go to Lunavla. So at what time you will be reached at that timing? What will be the traffic conditions over there in the Lunavla? So friends, all of this scenario, like you will be notified easily from infrastructure, from other pedestrians, from other different vehicles easily. So friends, overall V2X is a complete road safety and traffic efficiency solutions provider kind of the communication technology that allows a particular vehicle to communicate with the surrounding system, surrounding media. So when we say a vehicle, that vehicle can be anything. It can be an ambulance which is looking for 
a nearby hospital it can be a bus a car a truck it could it can be any of the automobile system similarly ref, uh, when we refer to the pedestrians the pedestrian can be a cyclist a disabled person who is uh, trying to cross the road a scooter or a pedestrian it can be anything so, and when when we talk about the infrastructure the infrastructure could be uh, the traffic lights the road signs the other other uh, infrastructures the big buildings in the city it can be anything in case of the infrastructure so friends there are basic two types of this v2x communication systems that is for the shorter range and the longer range in case of the so shorter range it uses the ad hoc and side link uh, kind of the systems now this particular system is mainly suitable for the shorter distances that is less than 1 km that is between the direct communication between the vehicle to vehicle vehicle to pedestrian or as the vehicles to other uh, infrastructure that is nothing but the direct communication over here so well basically this could be a cellular based or else the direct based that is nothing but the wifi based the protocol which is using over here it is IEEE 802.11p so this is nothing but the protocol which is used in this kind of the direct system that is suitable for the shorter distances in case of the longer distances we could go for the iot and the other different networks we could rely on the 4g and the 5g networks which is there in the all of this uh, scenario so over here and in a network based that is mainly suitable for the longer distances majority like more than 1 kilometers it it uses the nb iot systems that is the narrow band iot internet of things and basically it uses a network the edge services 4g 5g kind of the services so these are the two different types of the uh, v2x communication systems so let's take an another example over here suppose an ambulance suppose there is an ambulance and uh, it needs to reach a hospital at a desired time span so if all the vehicles which are there on the road on that pathways they having the v2x technology enabled so all the vehicles will get notified that there is ambulance is coming in their way so that this system allows all the vehicles to rearrange themselves and provide a path for that particular ambulance to reach the hospital in a stipulated time period so over here a life is getting saved just because of this v2x communication so friends this is nothing but the v2x communication but these all are the advantages of the v2x communication all of the safety reliability enhanced level of uh, uh, traffic monitoring all of these are the advantages but there are some drawbacks suppose in the in this v2x communication if there is a minute uh, problem or as there is there is a problem regarding the sensor of the automobiles then the this system will not work for that uh, vehicle this particular system relies on the internet so like the chances of hacking will be more in near future also this particular system like it uh, gives all the users data so it monitors all the users data so over here a uh, privacy uh, could uh, like it is getting compromised between of the privacy of the user the privacy of that particular vehicle is getting compromised because all the data all the location information is getting stored so over here the privacy could be another issue in the near future so that is all about the v2x kind of the technology so friends tell me in the comments what you think about this v2x kind of technology whether it will be a game changer or it will be a problem in the future please tell me your thoughts in the comments so friends thank you so much for watching this educational informative video please do subscribe and keep me motivated thank you